are you tired of boring salads? Or maybe you want to eat healthier, but the idea of eating a salad doesn't sound particularly exciting. Well, worry not, because today I'm sharing three simple tips to help you make a salad that you can actually enjoy. And the reason that I'm sharing this one today is because yesterday I had a bomb salad. <laughs> it was so good, and I thought, you know, people are always complaining that healthy doesn't taste good, but here's the reality. Healthy shouldn't be hard. Sometimes you just need some simple tips and tweaks to help you um, get the life-sustaining and life-saving vitamins and minerals that exist inside of plants. So how do you do this, CC? Well, hey, first of all, I'm CC Cheney, and I am here with some simple tips for you today. So tip number one, got my little handy notes here. Give your lettuce base a remix, okay? Iceberg lettuce does not make a yummy salad, okay? I'm just gonna say that, okay? Um, but play with different mixes, right? T try out different lettuces, uh, different greens, and spice things up. And one of my favorite ways to mix things in is to chop up some herbs, right? Like fresh herbs, basil is my absolute favorite. Add that to your salad base, and it just gives it a brighter, more delicious taste um, and actual vitamins and minerals, right? So if you're looking for um, a simple solution, that's gonna be something that you can do really easily. Try out some new things, chop up some herbs, chop everything up kind of fine. If you chop um, your salad up into smaller pieces, it actually allows you to get different bites, right? So do that, mix in things, right? Maybe you'll add some microgreens, uh, maybe you'll add, um, some, some sprouts, right? But there are different things that you can do for that lettuce base to spice things up a little bit. Tip number two, play with texture, right? Like crisp, soft, crunchy. Like there's different things that you can do that can really take your salad to the next level. So yesterday, the salad that I had had crispy uh, lentils. Yep, my eye is watering for one second. Sorry about that. Had crispy lentils in there. Also, a yummy one is crunchy chickpeas, right? You could do um, crunchy onions. There's all these things that you can do to add texture, right? Soft avocado, uh, crisp fruit like apples, right? There are all of these things that you can do that will bump up the flavor, but that will also bump up um, the texture and make it really something pretty. So one of the things uh, with my style yesterday, I had zoodles, um, um, zucchini, I had zoodles, carrots, I had the crunchy lentils in there, um, crisp lettuce, right? So you want to be playing with your textures so that you can really make it something delicious. Hey, by the way, do you see my super cute um, thing that I created? <laughs> I made that myself and I love it. Okay, and tip number three is Find a dressing that you love, right? And so sometimes we get a little monotonous with our salad dressing. Maybe you just love ranch or maybe you just love Italian or whatever it is. But sometimes it's fun to play with um, the flavor uh, enhancers that we add. Maybe you add salsa or guacamole this time, right? Maybe you do a homemade dressing. Though, If you're in the States especially, you have tons of options, like literally tons of op options. Um, and you can play with those things to just spice things up a little bit. My current favorite is a avocado-based vegan um, Caesar dressing. I absolutely love it. Like I throw everything into my blender, you know, whiz it up, pour it on top, and it just is like a fa flavor explosion. It's my favorite thing. If you want the recipe for that, feel free to shoot me a message. Um, but play with, play around, right? Maybe you want a fruity um, salad dressing one day and another day you want to go savory. Maybe one day you want to go spicy, right? If you're somebody who's trying to maybe eat, you know, um, more salads in, in a week, for example, you can play with your dressings to make the experience more fun for you, more palatable for you. Because if you actually like what you're eating and you don't feel like you're just forced to eat something, you will be able to put more of the good stuff in your body. Okay, so those are the three tips. Again, change up the lettuce base, play with texture, and find a dressing that suits your needs. So if you'd like the, uh, the recipe for that Caesar dressing that I love right now, shoot me a message. Otherwise, have a fabulous day, and I will chat with you soon. Ciao.